<laughs> Is everybody here? Welcome to Stephanie Sue's kitchen. We only produce Michelin star here. Eight course meals only. The best of the best. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but a couple days ago my mother has joined us in quarantine in Southern California and this has caused a very interesting dynamic in this house. We have five people where we all have separate interpersonal relationships and so I thought what a better way than get to know everyone individually than an eight course meal because there is so many courses. You get to know everybody so intimately. Today's video is going to be an eight course different types of ramen. There's going to be a dessert with ramen. There's going to be a cheese plate with ramen. There's going to be pasta with ramen. There's going to be a Hawaiian dish with ramen. So I got my sous chef, Mr. Mango Butt here, working pro bono. We've got Dan Dan Yim working pro bono right here. And I have prepped on how to make this the most efficiently run kitchen by playing Cooking Fever. Thank you Cooking Fever for sponsoring today's video. Let me show you guys the game. First of all, listen, you think that my job is easy, right? You play like four hours. <laughs> you think that my job is easy. Being a YouTuber is easy, but Cooking Fever, doing this whole run in the kitchen, making sure every customer gets what they ordered in a timely manner, that is not easy. I don't want you guys to underestimate this game. This game is honestly the most addicting game ever. Ever since I was younger, I loved cooking games, but this one has some sort of a rush to it. It's not just about making the food. It's about making the food. You've got five different customers walking in at once. You know, some of them want a hot dog, some of them want a hamburger, and some of them just want to drink it. You gotta collect the coin, you gotta make sure they're not angry because then they're not gonna tip you, and you need to get that tip. They don't tip? Yeah. If you guys are quarantined at home like we are, and you guys have nothing to do, you can play this game, and you can cook all of these delicious foods, and learn how to manage all of this stuff, and the best part of it is I didn't know this until I was like two hours in and I collected all my gold coins and I opened up my own bakery. Yes, you don't have to stick to hamburgers and hot dogs. You can even design your own kitchen to make it really pretty. You can design your own restaurant to get more customers and they just recently collabed with Hard Rock Cafe. Now, I don't have enough coins to buy a Hard Rock Cafe yet, but I'm getting there. And all of this is free to download. I'm gonna link it in the description because trust me, I'm not that into mobile games, but I do spend quite a bit of time on Cooking Fever. Honey, Dan Dan, you here? Oh, you have to put the hot dogs on the ground. You have to put the hamburgers on the ground. Go, 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 go. Collect the coin. Collect the coin. Collect the coin. Collect the coin. You gotta give him a burger. Ah. Get the coin. Get the coin. Ah. Wow, this is fun. Right? You gotta put the buns, you gotta put the buns, you gotta put the buns. <gasps> All right, you got one shot. How do you know when the bun's done? Hold on, I can't talk to you right now. Oh shoot, oh shoot. If you don't take the money on the desk, will the next customer take it? I don't think so. I don't think they're that evil, maybe. I would. <laughs> That's yes. what you've been spending all your time doing. Yes, sir. <laughs> wow. Three stars. Move aside. Chill, everybody chill. Everybody, everybody, yes, everybody. everybody chill. Hi, she's getting upset. She's not getting upset. She just rolled her eyes, man. Thank you so much. <laughs> there you go, sir. What do you want? You want a coffee? There you go, man. There you go, man. There you go. Oh, Aww. you got two stars. He beat me. So I am the head chef. You're my right hand man, and you an intern. <laughs> Thank you, Cooking Fever, for sponsoring today's vlog. And we are going to do an eight course ramen meal. Now this is going to be really intense because not only is it gonna be an eight course ramen meal, there's going to be a valet, a coat check. There will be a live performance by a beautiful singer in between courses. You got some good budget, huh? <laughs> <laughs> she's a surprise singer. You haven't heard from her yet, but she's a rising star. She really? sings in, um, no, Stephanie. <laughs> <laughs> now, I don't know how to pronounce all of this, but for or, Audible. Can you pronounce that? Audible. We are going to be making a ramen deviled egg. Now for the soup, we are going to have gold bowl ramen. Now this is inspired by the original Korean gold bowl ramen. And we're going to have a banana milk with a banana martini on the side. Appetizer, nuclear ramen cheese plate with green onions and some sauces. <laughs> Salad is an aloha ramen. Entree is a ramen carbonara. Aren't you supposed to like, explain this to me as a customer? Like you bring the menu and tell me what You're right. Person. So as an employee, get them eggs, boo-boo. <laughs> Soy sauce, water. No, I don't need that, actually. This is really stressful to run a kitchen. I wish I could just play cooking fever instead of doing this. So you're going to be in charge of the ramen devil eggs, okay? So we have some eggs. This is a Michelin star restaurant. So what's important? Mm -hmm. Plating. You have to be able to put mm -hmm. some flowers on I'm it. Good at that. Some mango hair, you know, whatever Man. you need. <laughs> Tiger's butt hairs. Whatever you think will 
elevate the dish to the next level. So we have some soy sauce braised eggs, okay? Now these are ramen deviled eggs. So what I need you to do is cut the eggs in the half very delicately. Take out the egg yolk, mm -hmm. get a ramen seasoning pack. Mix the egg yolk, ramen seasoning pack, a little bit, not too much, with some mayonnaise. Whip it up mm -hmm. so it should be fluffy. Put it into a Ziploc bag, cut the end, ice it back onto the egg, sprinkle with crushed ramen noodles. Okay, well you might have to repeat that. I got it, Thank I'll you. do that. Yeah. I'll do that. You do that one? Yeah. You are going to make the soup. The soup is a traditional mm. Korean inspired ramen. So you're gonna make a tiny ramen, put it in here. In here, what do Koreans love to drink? Mm. Martinis. Martini. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alcohol. Banana milk. Ah. <laughs> you're so <laughs> Banana uyu. So you're gonna put the banana uyu and then get a toothpick and put sliced banana through it like a okay. martini. All right. I'm gonna make a cheese plate. So I'm talking ramen noodles, sauces, you know, other stuff. Green mm. onions on the side. Mm. So that will be the first three courses. What about the rest of the five? <laughs> You are doing the aloha ramen. Now I will do the entree, which is a ramen carbonara. Mm. This is a no cream original carbonara. You sir, you're gonna do the dessert. Ooh, chocolate covered ramen? Yes sir. <laughs> so here's the thing, how do we make sure nothing gets cold? I didn't really think about that. We can microwave it. That's where cooking fever came in. You have to manage, like, nothing gets overcooked, everything's warm, mm. and then you have to serve it in a timely manner. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the cheese plate. You should start with the dessert, the chocolate covered mm -hmm. ramen. I'm gonna with, start with devil egg. Yeah, and then we go into the hot stuff, okay? Uh -huh. So let's go to it. I'm let's gonna go. get my stuff. Y'all know what you need? Yes, ma'am. All right, yes, chop, chop, cooking fever. I don't pay y'all for nothing. I don't what? pay them. <laughs> He's like, wait, we're getting paid? You don't pay nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make a trip to our inventory. Let's go to the ramen drawer, Hannah. Okay, so ironically, this is in the gym. <laughs> and also, I want to put a quick disclaimer. A lot of this was sent in PR, and a lot of this was acquired before everything happened. So this is not us hoarding. This just actually is. Okay, what kind of ramen you like? I like nuclear the best. I need a carbonara. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. So for my cheese plate, I'm gonna use a carbonara, one of these PB myeons, and a puldak pokum myeon. These three are gonna be my main carbonara cheese plate, whatever you call it, dishes. How you doing with the deviled eggs, sir? Wow, whoa, what's happening? Oh my, wow. Design matters too. Wow, design is everything. Yep. Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay, but I have to admit, that's very satisfying. You get a raise, sir. I am promoting to you to up. Uh, okay. The ugliest egg. What happened? So we've got chocolate melter over here. You gotta um, measure it, you yeah. know? Like, yeah, with your eyeballs. Like half. Half is uh -huh. good. Yeah. Half is good. I have a feeling he's gonna need more, <laughs> but you know what? It's not my dish. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit creative. I've got this little dim sum bowl. This is gonna come in handy. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna <laughs> add a little bit of butter because... Um, uh-huh. You'll see, you'll see. How much time do you think we have left, chefs? I think uh, we, we're doing really good and uh, I'm almost done. I'm almost done too. What? Uh, chef, do you think you're better than Gordon Ramsay? I think so. I think there's a reason y'all are here, no? Yeah, you Learning might. from the best of the best. <laughs> I always thought Gordon Ramsay mm -hmm. is overrated, chef. I think you're underrated, chef. Thank you so much. Y'all know I'm not paying you, right? <laughs> yes, you're putting chef. butter into chocolate? Yeah. Just trust me. <laughs> Have you done this before? No. Are you putting milk? Mm -hmm. So you did butter, chocolate, and milk. All right, I'm leaving your ass. Okay, let me see what right you're right you're right doing. Right um, you should cut a bigger hole. That looks weird. Mm. Oh god, that's gross. Oh god, you're supposed to do like three, one big swirl, honey. It was <laughs> I'm gonna grab this and add in the seasoning pack. So you know how the black bean one comes with the little vegetables? Here's the thing that nobody knew. You can actually just put them in warm water and they will rehydrate. You don't have to boil them. Did you know that? Who do you think is the best cook out of all of us? It's you, chef. It's you, chef. Why is everybody being so nice today? Did something happen? Did y'all break something? If anything is broken, it must be Dan Dan, chef. No, it must be your dish. Oh! <laughs> what? My dish? How is your, how is our customer's taste palette? A little bit more, right? Our customer's taste palette mm -hmm. is Korean. I forgot to ask, is she allergic to anything? Yeah, she's allergic. Great question. <laughs> <laughs> Failure. She's allergic to failure. So she's allergic to you? Hey! Wow, look at that, guys. Melted. <laughs> here, I have put the carbonara noodles. Or no, the carbonara sauces here. This side is the black bean sauce. 
and now we're going to unleash the noodles. Now, the way that I've learned pasta noodle plating from a TikTok chef is to grab it like this and to place and to twirl, 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 twirl. Did we all wash our hands? Yes. Wow, I like that design though. Thank you. Yeah. Well, you guys are trying too hard. You guys are trying too hard to impress. You're not trying hard enough. I'm trying to impress her with the food itself. Not all these fluff and shit. Oh yeah? Mm -hmm. Pile of noodles there. Now. Do you think that my mom's gonna think that we're so weird? <laughs> and stoops for doing this? Oh. Uh, he no. said she might think this is the best thing that we've ever done. <laughs> So my fiance is holding a mango asking me what is Hawaiian <laughs> and I'm not entirely sure either so this kind of gives you a background on our culinary expertise. Right now I'm going to go into the entree because this little thing yeah. is going to be done very soon. This is the cheese board. I'll show you guys the final product later. The entree, I'm going to need two eggs. Now I'm just going to use one egg yolk because you want it to be very creamy, very fluffy. This is a carbonara. Crack the egg. Wow. You got one egg. Crack another egg. He's about to make the most stunning banana milk. He's whopping the banana milk that he's just spilt everywhere because he's <laughs> embarrassed. And he is putting the banana milk into the blender with the ice cubes and he's gonna make a blended banana martini. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I gotta get this cheese and now I have to shave down the cheese. It's not my proudest work. Can I just be a customer, y'all? No. <laughs> I'll be the server. How about that? I'll be no. the server. You have to find someone to replace you. We need three chefs. Okay, I'll call your mom. No. <laughs> Justin! Justin! Would you like to be a chef? Honey? Yes? Yeah. Can I have your number? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Justin. Hi. 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 Oh my god, what are you guys doing? How did that oh, happen? What is going on? And Dan, you better make the most amazing martini uh -huh. this world has ever freaking seen. You know how to make real martini? Oh yeah. No, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, yeah. Stop what? it already. He spilled Dan, like Dan. the whole thing into the sink. Dan, Dan. Ew, disgusting. Oh, it's gonna taste good, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna grate some cheese. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Just sit here in silence, honey. I think I think I quit. No, <laughs> I quit. You don't get to quit. I quit. Honey, just make your aloha ramen right now. <laughs> I'm just a server here. Whoa, whoa, you better fucking finish I'll your dish. Aloha. How many courses do we have? Now? Eight, eight. We have. We can't do eight I, courses. Okay, then fuck two of them. We still gotta do six. Okay, well, I have one each. ready. I have one. Part. I got two, baby. He is putting the banana milk. So we got four courses. <laughs> That's a lot. Here's a piece of ramen. No, it's not the same. I'm dusting. <laughs> I'm dusting. <laughs> some seasoning on there. Bro! Oh, bro, yeah. the f are you doing? What do you call that dish? I'm gonna call it. I call this dish divorce. You want, you want some tangerine in your ramen? That sounds healthy, honestly. Justin, you wanna make some aloha noodles? What is aloha noodles? I don't know. You're the chef. Okay, I can try. Justin, this is your time to shine, okay? That's not, that's cheating. Show us your skill, show us your talent. Cheating. Welcome to the house of Sue. Introducing. <laughs> Introducing our wonderful employee, Justin. I would say that he has the most impeccable style today. Thank you. Now please exit. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Introducing another employee. <laughs> Welcome, Dan Dan. <laughs> Honey, you look like you will never be manager. You will never be promoted. I'm not here. I'm, I'm not here. I'm just here to like have fun. He got the job because he knows the owner, okay? The party last night is so lit. <laughs> All right, exit. So lit. And I am your hostess, Sue, from the house of Sue. We are opening in five, four. Everybody take your places. Three, two, ballet. One. <laughs> How are you doing today? Have you been to this restaurant before? Korean. Um, restaurant? First time? 
Uh, I'm several times. This is your extra napkin. Are you allergic to anything? No allergies? No. No? Okay, perfect. We'll be right out with your first course and the chef will be right with you. <laughs> Hello, ma'am. This is ramen double egg. Enjoy. Thank this you. This is prepared, prepared 18 hours with the finest chicken. This was voted as a world record of most desired egg in the world. My mom is so bored. <laughs> Bro. She said it's good. Oh. Okay. Thank you very Thank you. much. <laughs> Thank you so Thank much. You. Hello? <laughs> do, you, do you like do you like banana? How about seaweed? Please introduce it, Dan. Banana milk? Or we call it banana martini. That's a seaweed soup. If you you know Miss Korea. That's perfect. <laughs> she said it's delicious but incredibly cold. It was windy outside. Oh god, that looks kind of gross, Dan Dan. It's oh, very healthy well. for you. Please, I tried. Please. Okay, okay. Try my best. She said okay. Thank you. Wow, that looks serious. Thank you so much. This is the main course? No, no. This, oh, this is, is an appetizer. appetizer. This is a cheese ramen board. Mm. So today we have some kimchi noodles. We've got, this is nuclear jajangmyeon sauce. You dip and you eat. Mm. You've got carbonara sauce. Okay. And the chopstick. Oh, and the chopstick. <laughs> <laughs> You're so beautiful. <laughs> I love my mom. <laughs> 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 she said it's old. Uh, she said clear the table. Uh, and no tip. <laughs> 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 and no tip for this. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, yes. Wow. Oh. What is it? This is a sun. Oh. Sun. Mm -hmm. What do you call a news anchor that reports to the sun? Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> this is Harry Potter. Enjoy, man. Okay. I I Okay. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. 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 Next, we have Hawaiian noodles. Ooh. This will take your palate from a savory sweet dish. Should cleanse your palate. Ooh. Made especially by one of our executive chefs. Oh, oh. oh. Thank, Thank you. you so much. What? Oh. Mmm. Oh. Oh. Mm. Oh. 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 Today's entree is by the executive chef, master chef, sous chef extraordinaire. A beautiful ramen carbonara, creamy eggs, prosciutto rolls. Please enjoy. Okay. Please enjoy. To what? <laughs> <laughs> she said, if it is delicious, she will give me more. No response. <laughs> Okay, clear the table! <laughs> I would like to give your tip back because this is gonna be really bad. <laughs> Here's your money. Oh, it's okay. Oh, you get hot. Clear the table! Clear the table! <laughs> so, um, I'm glad you enjoyed your meal, ma'am. Your bill is here. Thank oh. you. <laughs> Tip. Tip, thank you, you so much. Down. Thank you so <laughs> Security! <laughs> You're security, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> what is a mic <laughs> Thank you for joining us at the House of Sue. This entire restaurant and video has been sponsored by none other than Cooking Fever. <laughs> <laughs> if you cannot recreate this wonderful eight-course Michelin star meal at home, 
which you probably can't because it takes an immense, enormous amount of talent and skill that I just can't imagine anyone else having. What level are you at now? Me? Yeah. Like a 29. Make sure to click the link in the description so that you too, maybe one day, could work for the House of Sue. And I will see you guys tomorrow. You look like the fucked up restaurant owner who steals people's tips. Whoa, what about the employees? Whoa! What happened to responsible? Guys, thank you for your hard work today. <laughs> You guys did so good. There, go buy some coins in cooking fever. <laughs> <laughs>